everyone. Let me just see if I can brighten slightly. Oops. That's a little bit better. The lights are usually really good, but I'm I think we're about heading towards like that darker side of the evening, aren't we? If I hold it forward a bit, you'd be able to see it perfectly anyway. The light in my room is actually amazing because you can see behind me I've got a full bay window. Anyway, I've got a second unboxing for this evening, which is the pink uh, sugar plum, the pamper box, which you've seen me unbox if you're quite a regular here several times and you all know how much I love it. So, if you can see just where my finger is pointing to there, it has got the URL website address, which is www.pinksugarplum.co.uk, just along the bottom. Now, this box is slightly different, differs to some other boxes that do like bath and pamper type of things because some of them tend to only have bath stuff, whereas this is an all rounder, it's got a bit of everything. You can get anything from shower, bath, candles, edibles, sweet treats, uh, tea, that kind of thing. There's absolutely everything you can get in this, which is why I love it, because whereas it does have quite a few bath items, it also has other things that I can use when I do not have time always to have a bath. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, it smells amazing. Ah, oh, I've just opened the lid. Oh, that is something else. Oh, what's that that smells like? Right, okay. I'll get um, sidetracked. Okay, I'm gonna hold this up with skill. Can you see? So it always comes wrapped with their paper, which is so pretty, because it's always printed pink sugar plum. And the cards are now, they used to be like the same design, but the cards are now like double side printed as well. So they've got this beautiful, you can see, I'll put it right in front of my face so you can just see that, you don't need to see me. <laughs> so it's got the, it says hello beautiful and it's got pinksugarplum.co.uk. Obviously they are on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter. And the handles for them, for the tags for Instagram, I learned this last month when she put it on there. It's PSP Bath Treats, but if you actually search Pink Sugar Plum, you will find them. So the theme for this month is floral, which you can smell as soon as you open that. So if I peel back, I'm always dead scared that when I do this. Do you know one day I really am gonna drop the entire contents of a box? And then do you know what I'll probably do? I'll probably like stop the recording and start it again. <laughs> Be so embarrassed, wouldn't you? Right, see if I can hold it up. Can you see? That's a little sneak for you. The box is always rammed full. Like there's always so much in it. Like it's heavy and then I always know what it is because it comes with like a pink mailing bag on it as well. So it's always got that it's come from pink sugar plums. So I know straight away as soon as I see it, I'm like, yay. Oh, everybody needs a bit of bar now, don't they? Right. So what I'll do is I'll pick out one item at a time. Um, I'll pick it out in the list order, so then it's a bit easier and I don't forget where I am. Right. So, oh, that's what I can smell. Because it, it hits you as soon as you open. Okay, so it is Lavender Essential Oil Bath Bomb. You can really, really smell it as well. And it says, relax with this essential oil bath bomb like lords and I love lavender and it's so relaxing so I'm thinking like I'm at work tomorrow I've got to do two till ten I'm not going to get back to about 11 o'clock at night but on Sunday oh my god am I going to need a rest so this would be the perfect thing for me on Sunday to stick in my bath and just kick the kids out <laughs> so and I know that my other half won't steal this one because he didn't like lavender so that's the first one I'm going to pop it behind me just on the bed so that because there's that much in it I don't want to be like dropping anything so the next one is oh yes yay i'm really happy about this it is rose pumice foot soap i can smell it a bit it is sealed because obviously you don't want to make a mess and i don't want to get it out right now but i'm really happy about this because I've just mentioned on my previous unboxing, uh, I am going on holiday in eight days and I need to do my feet because uh, next Saturday, before I go away, I'm having them painted. So I'll get my nails done. You'll see anyway. I've always got different nails on my uh, unboxing. Uh, but I'm getting my feet done as well because obviously I'm walking around the beach and stuff. I don't want people to see my horrible toes that are, don't look nice. So this is one of those that you just scrub the bottoms of your feet with. So it'll be all like, um, you know, they're quite abrasive, you know, to get rid of all your dead skin and stuff. So that's going to come in really handy for me. So yes, I'm really happy. It's a big size as well, that. 
Rose Fresh Book Pumice Soap. I don't say what size it is, is it? Oh yeah, it does. 110 grams, massive. But if you look, because the bath bombs are always massive in this box, you can see how big it is. So, right, that is the second item. What's the next one? Oh, we've spoiled this month for number two. Ooh, I'm smelling them before I'm showing them to you. <laughs> so, this is a Daisy Petals Bath Bomb, and it is shaped in a heart, and it's bright pink, as you can see. And you can smell it through there as well. It's obviously, the theme's floral, so <laughs> you get that, don't you? But this is so nice. I love sniffing them. I'm so glad because last week I had a horrible cold, like really bad. And now my sense of smell has come back full whack. I can smell everything. Oh, yes. It says designer perfume scented bath bomb. Oh, so it's... Oh, yeah, it is. It's um, Marc Jacobs. Daisy. Oh, there you go. So I'll pop that to one side. That's our third. I lose count. I always do. Um, Next one is, by the list, is this little cute thing. How sweet is that? I do use these as well because uh, I can't remember where I got them from, but you know you get those little like, little, like egg cup holders type thing. You know, egg boxes. And you can go and you can buy them in little egg boxes and buy loads of these like together. They're like six or eight or whatever and have them in a little tray. And this one is peony. I can smell this as well. It's amazing how you think there's that much smelly stuff and you can still smell stuff. Oh, yes. So it says subtle floral bath melt made with skin loving butters. Oh, yeah, that'd be really nice. It's lovely, that. I think they're so cute, and they're just such a nice thing. You just pop them in, and they've got a little, like, cake case type of thing. So there we go. That's number four. I'm counting correct because they're behind me. Right, what's the next one? And this is one that made me smile when I opened it the most because I'm about that much. I've used my whole bottle from the last... Was it last month or the month? Last month. I've used that one already, but I was using something else, and I've used it nearly. And so I've got this one now. Yes. Oh, and this is just, this is lavender vanilla. Let me flip the lid on it so I can get a proper smell. Oh, this is so sweet. I love it when they're sweet. And it's a big bottle as well. So it's a 250. And let me just see if it says anything. Yeah, it's got who it's made, but I'll pop that in the full review anyway. But it's lavender vanilla. And it says dreamy scented body wash. It's just so nice. I love lavender stuff because it, it I do as well, Amy, because it chills you out. It, I'm like, oh, I just want to relax. And then Rob says, oh, Mel, I don't like stuff like that. And I'm like, oh, shut up and go and sleep in another room then. <laughs> it's the only thing he doesn't like, lavender, and I love it. It's gorgeous. I've got all those little pillow things as well. Oh, I stick him in the drawer and then I'd stick him in his drawer as well on purpose just to wind him up. <laughs> nice girlfriend, Mayana. So that is the fifth item. He doesn't have to smell it, does he? God, these men like to moan, don't they? Um, <laughs> so, the next item is, and I will just hold it up. I've had one of these before, but a different one, obviously. And this is Violet. So it's Soy Potter Fragrance. I think it was the same make of the other one that I had. I can't remember what it was. I can't remember the fragrance. I, I can't, honestly, I've used it now, so I'd have to check back on my review. Oh, yes. This is Violet. It does smell purple violets. So you can see, I really like these as well because, I don't know if I mentioned it last time, because I've got long nails, they've got a really long wick. You can see how far it comes up above there. So it's really, it was really easy for me to light. I also like the fact that you can just like put it back and then stick the little cork lid on it. So yeah, really cute. It did last a while. I can't remember how long, but I've used it now. So it was a few months ago and I've had another candle. I think that's the third candle I've had in these boxes this year. So... Which, you know, it's really good because you get a bit of everything. It's not too much. You're not, like, getting loads of the same thing every month. So, uh, where, did, uh, where, did, uh, where are we? Right, okay. We'll go by... Oh, actually, and I was just saying, I need to chill out as well. I, honestly, if anybody... Like, you, I know that some of the girls, you know me personally, and I have had a bit of a stressful week. And I feel like I was losing the plot. So, um, this is just the right time for this land today. So, the next item is... Twinings and it is sleep. Um, it's a obviously floral herbal tea, and it just says apple, vanilla, chamomile, and passion flowers. And and I really need some sleep. Do I do I look like I need some sleep? I have actually got dark circles under my eyes. I'm gonna have a sleep because I'm on late shift tomorrow, so I'll uh, I'll have that tonight and go to bed well rested, hopefully. So that is what we are number seven. 
And then we've got our sweet treat for the month. And I've not tried these. I must be the only person who hasn't managed to get one of these. Wasn't there something somewhere about like they all sold out? Or am I imagining that? It's, it is the Ruby cocoa beans it's the pink kit kat basically let's just say it as plainly as it is but i remember saying somewhere that like these come out and then they all sold and somebody and they couldn't, people couldn't get them or something like that i could be wrong correct me if i'm wrong but i've not tried this and that could be why because i've obviously i do work in a supermarket <laughs> but uh yeah i've not seen them on our shelves anyway so i'm excited to try it because i do like kit kats but i am gonna have to hide this from archie because he also likes kit kats so uh yeah i'm gonna eat this later and that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the last but not least is my actually one of my favourite things in this because I think it's so unique. I've got my little Kirby grip here ready to scratch it off. And it's a scratch and reveal. So let's see what I've got this month. Ah. That one won't work. Let's try again for something else. It's not flat enough. You know what I mean? You need it to be flat, the edge. It's a rounded edged one. I thought it was being prepared then. Right, I'm scratching it off of the edge of my tweezers now. Right, let's see what we got. And it says, free mystery gift. Oh, so I don't even know what this one is. I've had things like three, free bath bombs and stuff like that. And uh, like percentage discount off. And that's a free mystery gift. So, I'll put my finger over the code so you can't see. But you do actually scratch it like a scratch card. I love that. I just love the like total like... Oh. I'm a kid, Anna. I just love things like that, honestly. I'm one of these people where I don't buy scratch cards from the shop because if I did, I'd be buying 20 a day because I just love the whole, like, fact of scratching stuff. I think ages ago, I was making something with the kids and you can make them where you put wax on and then you cover it in, like, a chalk paint, like a black chalk paint, so you can scratch the, the thing off and you get the colours underneath and I was in my element doing that, I kid you not. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm totally digress now. So, the cost of this box and the discount code for 20% off is box 20. The cost of this box is 19 99 plus 3 95 postage and packaging. But if you take the 20% off, it obviously works out that the box is just under £20 because you get the box for 16 ish plus your postage. So, it's just shy of 20 quid delivered. And it is worth a mention as well because it's one of the reasons I do this box as opposed to other boxes because there are other bath boxes and things out there. Is this is completely cruelty free and to me that's a big thing. Um, also, most of the items are handmade and they co or they come from like smaller handmade companies where obviously Haley owns a company buys them from, um, and it's a massive thing for me that. So I don't think I've, I've mentioned it in my reviews before. I wouldn't I wouldn't unbox it and review it if it wasn't cruelty free because it's it's a big thing and obviously my kids do use stuff as well. So I don't want to be giving them things that aren't um, you know I've got ethics when it comes to stuff like that so right that is it if you want to watch this back i was going to pop these back in so there's my candle going back in there's that one i'm not going to go through them one by one because it takes me too long one bath bomb two bath bombs and that was the little bath melt that i showed you the foot pummy and there's my kit kat and there's my drink and there's that's my favorite I'm going to use this soon. I need a shower. I've had one today, but I'm going to have one anyway, just for the sake of it. <laughs> and my little scratch card as well. So, that is Pink Sugar Plum, the pamper box, and I really enjoy it. If you want to watch my um, previous unboxings or read back of my previous reviews, just go on our website at the top corner, type in Pink Sugar Plum, it'll bring them all up. You'll be able to have a look, the kind of things that you can get. Um, yeah, I definitely recommend it. So... That is it from me this evening. You are not going to see me again today. You are not going to see me again tomorrow because I'm at work all day till 11 o'clock. So I am going to enjoy this on Sunday and I will try my best to get the review done by Tuesday at the very latest um, so you can all have a read. And that's it. Head over if you want to order and um, have a lovely evening. Bye for now.